Yo guys, welcome back to another video. And there is a Forza Fun event today, starting Tuesday, July the 4th. It's five days long, so it will include the upcoming weekend as well. So the cars you can win is the 1970 Chevelle Super Sport Horizon Edition, and you can also win the Ferrari 599XX. They're both cars we've seen before, so yeah, there's not really a lot of hype about them, to be honest. So in this video, I'm going to go and get the 1970 Chevelle and the Ferrari 599XX. So to get the Ferrari 599XX, you just need to perform 20 Ultimate Air skills. Literally so simple, you just need to come to the sand dunes over here, in the outback, right next to the airstrip, and you just need a bit of speed, I guess, and that'll be an Ultimate Air skill. Yep, so you just need 20 of them, and they are pretty easy to get. Like, some challenges are just really easy with skills and, and some just aren't like the obesity style skills a lot of people struggle with that one even though like people like me and other youtubers made videos on how to do it it was very hard even like i struggled with it. it took me like half an hour to get it was actually crazy how tricky it actually was i kind of like how they do uh force funds where you have to get skills as well because you learn what the skills are and it kind of puts a point to the skills being in the game, like, otherwise no one would really take any notice of it, like in Horizon 2. Just no one cared, really. Plus, you only needed 65 skill points, and then you unlocked everything in that game, so it was kind of stupid, really. We're getting these good, good ultimate air skills now, though. We're actually racking them up. Let's have a look on achievements, how many we've got. Oh, there we go, we nearly got it. 55%, so we've got 11 now. So you just need nine more, that'll be one. So simple, just drive around in an S2 all-wheel drive car, and then you've got it. Oh god, that's very high art. This won't be one though, that won't be one. Um let's go up here. We're gonna get one there, definitely. And then if we just go in a straight line, there'll be another one. Yep. Uh, we'll just need to pull a quick UE there. Oh nice, nice, nice. This was an auction house car I think I bought a while ago. It was just, it's pretty nice, I use it sometimes for races and stuff. <laughs> yeah, it's good because it's S2 class, all wheel drive, it looks pretty nice as well. It's got the Horizon Edition tyres on it. And we just managed to save that for some reason. Don't know how though. Surely we're nearly finished now. And we need like one or two more probably. I just want to see the achievement pop up. We're getting a lot of them actually. We're nearly at 20 now. Come on. Surely now. By now. After. Yeah, there we go. Rare achievement unlocked. Force form bursting in the air. Performance annuals with air skills from Winter Ferrari 599XX. Now we need to complete three races in classic muscle to win the 1970 Chevelle. Let, let, let's go and do this, I guess. I don't really use this Horizon Edition car, so I just guess I'm going to use it. I used it once for skill points, a skill point video. A little, little screenshot on screen right now. Yeah, that video, I kind of was, I kind of thought it was going to go pretty good. Like, you know, back then, didn't really have many subscribers, probably around 50 subscribers. And I thought, oh, I'll pull in 100 views on this. Fairly decent. Those were days, now I pull in easily 600 views on a bad day now. Yep, 600 views on a bad day, that's how good it is now. Let's start this race event, lads. Come on. We're in our Horizon Edition car, let's go. Bang, bang, bang. Gonna get all these cars. I've got it on e one of the easiest difficulties, mainly because the Forza Fun from the weekend, you had to win the championship, and I, it was, I did it when it was proper close to running out, I think, so I just wanted to get it done. And, like, I make everything, like, one lap long, so it's not that long. I just wanted to get it done. Same with here, really. Don't want a video to go on for too long now, do I? Because it's going to take longer to render, longer to, to upload. I've got to record another video after this for tomorrow. And maybe one for Tuesday. It's our recording grind right now. But we're easily in the lead. This uh, car's not bad. Should we go into first person? Mm, that's not bad. That's not bad, actually. That is not bad at all. Um, Last corner here. Do we need to break heavily? No. Yeah, this car takes these corners nice. I think I upgraded it myself as well a while ago. Not too sure about that, and we nearly hit the wall. But we came first. Literally, that's how long these races take. That moment when you wake up with hay fever, you know it's going to be a bad day. Let's go, Eastbridge Scramble, lads. Look at 
My Corvair, bright yellow. What is it doing? Absolutely mental stuff. Let's, we're just going to overtake all these, you know, easy difficulty. It's um, very OP. Now we're going to... Oh, it's the bridge one. If I was playing the hard difficult, everyone gets stuck right there. So annoying. Because no one wants to break for the corner. Especially online as well. Trying to do a full race on that corner in online, yeah? It's mental. Everyone just crashes. But if you take the corner nice, then... You make a few places up, especially if you start at the back. That is not bad at all. Now, I reckon we can do this in under 50 seconds. Maybe not. It's longer than I thought, actually. Definitely under a minute. I don't actually know what the shortest race is on this game. It's going to be one of these circuit events. Just thought I was going to hit a tree there, but glad I didn't. Uh, under fifth, under a minute, please. Under a minute, under a minute, please. Under a minute. It's Fifty-seven seconds. Get in there, lads. So, guys, final race of the championship. And no, I do not want to do that. Let's start this race event instead, and then we will win the Horizon Edition Chevelle. I've already got like one or two of them. I think. Is it that silver one or is it the blue Ford? I don't know. The picture is the blue Ford Mustang Boss. 302 something, Boss 302, is that right? It's a Mustang Boss Horizon Edition, it's got on the picture, the Ford's font. But then, that's not a Chevelle, is it? So, you know, there could be an error there by Turn 10 or Playground Games. So you never actually know. Actually, we're so close to 700 subscribers at the moment, we're like 19 away or something. That's what it was when I woke up, we're on 681, so yeah, subscribe if you're new around here. And I need to, I need to use Rewind there. So subscribe for some Forza Horizon 3 quality content. You won't be disappointed with these uploads, mate. Let's get it round here, boys. Let's go. Yes, there we go. Challenge Forza on Freedom of the Road. I didn't, I didn't actually see the achievement pop up. I was too busy talking. I was actually looking at my mic, to be honest, I know. Oh, well, let's go to the garage and go and see our beautiful cars we just got. Oh, my God, I'm actually a genius, lad. Stand back, stand back. I have just thought of the sickest video idea going. Literally, oh, dear, dear, dear. That is mental for me. I can't tell you what it is because I don't know if it'll actually work out with recording it and everything. But hopefully it does and it will be on the channel in the next five days. So there's the Ferrari 599XX we just won. There's the other one I've had from another time. I'm not really bothered about this car. I've never used it before, really. I've used that once in a race just to see what it's like. I'm not going to use that. Don't know why I have it twice then. Because, like, I might as well just sell it, but I probably won't. Let's go and go to the Chevelle. Where will the Chevelle be if we go to my car? So we can just go to the beginning. Um, come on, Chevelle. We need to see. Look at that Bugatti. Oh, that actually looks rubbish now. Come on, Chevelle, Chevelle. It's one of these, go. Is that... Oh, that's what we just won, isn't it? We just won one of those. Yeah, we won one of those. Okay. I already got one. I was meant to make a video on it a few months ago. Because that's when it came out, but I never did. I made the thumbnail and everything. But yeah. I, d I don't really want it again, to be honest. So I probably won't really use it. Or I just might for a video for... Sake of having it here. Yeah, look, it shows you the Horizon Edition Ford Mustang there. That, that, that is, um... What is it? I don't know what it's called. It's lies, really, basically, because I thought I was going to win that. Even though I knew you win a Cheval and that's a Ford, I just thought I'd win that, because it's the picture. I'm not actually going to drive these cars in this video, because that means the video will be 10 to 15 minutes long, and that is just going to be... Kind of boring because I don't really watch 10 to 15 minute long videos, so why would I upload one? Which I wouldn't watch myself. So no. This car's only got one wing mirror on it, on the driver's side. Well, how does he see out there then? Yeah, he's got rear view, but he can't see from there, can he? What if I wanted to move into an overtaking lane now? Bang, it's been an accident. Bad that. But I feel like more people are hyped about the Ferrari 599XX than this car. Literally, that's ev what everything was. Even though I put in the title of a video, you know, views. Even though the Ferrari's already been in the Forza font, and yes, this has two. But, 
I don't really like that Ferrari. I don't know, I just never use it. Even when it came out in the Force One the first time, I wasn't really bothered about it. But this, I was, because it's a Horizon Edition car. I love Horizon Edition cars. I've got every Horizon Edition car in the game now. Apart from that um, Mini Cooper John Works Horizon Edition, I've not got that. Oh, God, it's going to be good. But, yeah, subscribe for that. I'll catch you guys later. Peace out.